हेलो हेलो अथर यस यस आई 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 कैन हियर योर वॉइस कैन यू स्टार्ट योर कैमरा हाँ यस सर जस्ट मोमेंट ऐसा सॉरी जस्ट मोमेंट नो इशू नो इशू टेक योर टाइम I'm not sure why I'm not able to open it. So it says fail to start the video camera. Mm -hmm. Please select an another setting. I Just think. Okay. Yes, sir. You are. You are saying something. So it's not. I'm not able to connect it with my camera. Uh, no, no, it's so. Uh, we we are we are awaiting someone or we have no 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 with... no no. We are, we can start. We can start. Okay, Sharma, let's start. Yes, sir. Uh, no, no. Okay, no. so. Hi, hello, Arthur. Welcome, welcome again. Hi, sir. Uh, thank you for having me. Uh, okay, okay. No, hey, thank you for coming. Actually, okay. Um, <laughs> how's your day? Uh, so I I am just enjoying my holiday. So in Maharashtra, it's a Maharashtra day today. So okay, it's an off okay. for me. Okay, okay, okay. That's great. That's great. Okay. Ah, uh, Sharma sir. Doctor Sasmi Sharma. Sir. Yes. Yes, sir. Yes. Hi sir. Hello Atul. Hi sir. After long, so, after long time. Ah, yes. <laughs> yes. Yes sir. Yes, yes. We I had a conversation on the call, yeah. but I never met you. So yeah. yeah. So yes, I hope uh, you are doing good. Ah uh, yes sir, definitely. So this is a, a kind of an interaction which we would like to have with all our alumni students. Yes sir. So, we actually want to know a feedback from your end like mm -hmm. okay like uh, a few things like uh, we will start with any question sessions like okay um, uh -huh. so it's not like uh, like regular uh, interactions it will be like somewhat like question things you can give your own feedback so what you felt what you experienced okay. with those things right mm -hmm. Yes, sir. I feel like I would like to put a question on like uh, once you grab you have passed out your twelfth. Why did you yes, choose sir. Symbiosis University of Applied Sciences? Uh, so it's a, a very funny story. I I'll, I'll, I'll say when I met your one of my professor, Mr. Yogesh Pandya, sir. So I met him in an education fair. and i was very reluctant about choosing mechatronics as an uh, career uh, so i got attracted with him uh, he was an iit and i guess from uh, mumbai and he suggested i think you should at least visit the facility uh, the college university and uh, make your make up your mind after that so i was like i said i was very reluctant so i said okay just for the sake i'll visit and uh, we decided a date on a couple of days uh, from there and uh, then i got in symbiosis uh, on i guess so it was on a working the monday or tuesday so i came and uh, i saw the uh, facilities that uh, swas has like nikas newle uh, hydraulics lab we have we have a, a chemistry lab ic engines and all those so after that i you know i thought that, that this is what actually uh, a college lo should look like 
and then and after that i thought of mechatronics as a uh, career before that i was not sure that mechatronics would be uh, my career as specifically but after that yeah i definitely made up a mind to go with sciences right well said uh, <laughs> so in continuation to this i would like to put up a relevant question that yes, sir during those four years of your uh, mechatronics course yes, what sir. is the uh, your experience that you have taken out and after those four years of your mechatronics journey how do you feel right now uh so i'll say um simbas has played a, a very important part uh it's not just about mechatronics or the theoretical subjects we had uh, but uh, i think most of the students find idsc uh, as a fun subject but i found it very important when i look into the corporate life that i have uh, like i am currently in ceo office at fiat uh, so my day to day thing is all about soft skills i have technical but it's more of for soft skills so i think uh, idsc played a very important part uh, in uh, increasing my communication skills my presentation skills but uh, when i say overall as mechat as a mechatronics engineer i think uh, both practical part always plays an important role so these four years uh, were fun for me uh, i learned a lot in there and uh, i think this uh, this four years uh, includes a lot of what i have now Yes, sir. Uh, how how did these uh, Lucas Nule German setup labs uh, have worked out for you, or how you have used them? Uh, so Lucas this Nule. So uh, I am uh, like I'm currently working, but I would be further expanding my. Uh, educational scope i uh, would be doing uh, robotics and ai so newcast nule and all those uh, softwares that we had in uh, suas uh, helps uh, for deciding about robotics like robotics it's all about machines right so we have that hydraulics so we as uh, as a student do not have to put all the efforts but the machine that we have like newcast nule so we can easily connect uh, the uh, what we say uh, the so wires and all to get the desired output so we have a lot of uh, technology in there and what i see in my future scope uh, these softwares will play an important role so what is what is your opinion that we are giving that 70% skill and practical oriented and 30% <laughs> theory so uh, how does this help to you uh -huh. so uh, like i said uh, uh, theory uh, is like uh, 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 you are teaching a batsman to uh, sit on a offside and saying ki aise khelo bhai aise shots marte aise shots marte but until and unless he gets into ground and he actually plays a cover drive or hits a six he doesn't know the importance of those theoretical knowledge uh, theory yeah definitely has an importance but uh, com coming to the practicals of like uh, before this uh, in well, i was in this uh, ceo office i was in transmission so i, I was uh, able to engage in two of the cost reduction ideas so i was able to design two of the machines uh, using hydraulics pneumatics concepts as well as electronics so uh, without the practical knowledge uh, i don't think it's possible Uh, just being a, a, a book guy will not help you in any of uh, the things. So seventy percent uh, practical, yeah, does it does helps a lot. Yes. Share okay. your experience on the projects which you have done. How did uh, you get the support for projects from faculty and? So, uh, to be fair enough, I was uh, never involved in projects. Rather, I did internships at Lugong and Skoda, uh, which were both were given by Swas. The companies came on uh, campus, and uh, the projects uh, or the 
uh, what we say industrial place that I did was time study and the other was uh, CO2 emissions testing. So both these projects helped a lot uh, in my career point. Uh, like when I was in SCADA, uh, we hear a lot of things about, uh, you know, uh, big manufacturing companies, uh, you know, students get placed in that. And I think I was uh, lucky to be in SCADA uh, through Symbiosis, which uh, which helped me grow my confidence, uh, know how industry works. And saying about Lugong, uh, Lugong in Lugong, I learned how a manufacturing process, is, you know, is done from the start point till the end point. So it helped me a lot. And it does help me today itself, uh, today also and fiat uh, so yeah uh, the project's concept of one year is very nice which i really liked and uh, i think uh, i i was pretty lucky to get into into the companies and how about the professors that who taught you <laughs> so uh, i would say uh, i had a couple of professors in first year uh, which uh, like I had interaction with Yogesh Pandya sir, which I remember very, he was uh, like one of the, I won't say, um, he was one of the coolest guy, funniest guy. He used to teach concepts uh, very clearly and in a, in a fun way. We had a strict professor as well. So, so uh, professors in terms uh, were, were great at us and uh, I think uh, the faculty that we have today also uh, is very supportive. Uh, even I uh, uh, reach out to any of the faculties now, uh, they respond very quickly. And I think uh, that's like a uh, family bond we have. <laughs> right. I, I so, interacted with you also, sir, I guess. Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> we had an interaction. Yes, <laughs> right. <laughs> Right. Yes, sir. Uh, so, what about the placement facilities that you got from university? Uh, regarding the placement, uh, uh, SWAS did support a lot. Like I said, IDSC was one of the key things uh, to go uh, with an interview. You know, uh, I have a lot of uh, students. Like I was one of the GDs of a in a batch of twenty six, and uh, I stand out uh, aside just because I had the soft skills and uh, uh, to be very fair enough, I was uh, never a very technical sort of guy, but I love the IDSC session that we had. It promotes a, uh, a confidence in you. Uh, it encourages you to speak up for yourself and those things, you know, those little things helps you in your career. So uh, even when I say about the company that I got a chance to be interviewed for was Livang, Skoda, yeah, these are very big companies in India. So I think uh, I was lucky enough to be in the right time on the right place, I guess. What about uh, campus life of a student? Uh, Swas campus life? Oh, uh, sir, I think you I have asked the wrong question to the wrong guy. Uh, <laughs> I would say I was a very... Uh, in a in a in a unlucky situation because we had a COVID for two years, so we were on campus just for two years, and uh, I would say just for one year because the last year was internship, so I was never on the college for a long time, but uh, I missed that life. But I think I would be getting the, those days back. <laughs> <laughs> Hope so. You will be enjoying your campus life. Yes, sir. And, uh... <laughs> One last uh, uh, question from my side, like if any students, if they want to pursue their mechatronics course, mm -hmm. so what do you will suggest, like what is the future of mechatronics engineers? Uh, so mechatronics uh, does not limit you to just the me mechanical or the electronic side. Uh, it is a combination which will help you and is a future scope for many of the industries right now. So what we say industry 4.0, we have machine designs. Uh, so I have uh, some of my friends which are just electrical or electronics and they don't get the concept that I do just because I have the me mechanical side or the electronic side. Uh, and I think the uh, future of mechatronics is very bright 
uh, because we will be, you know, uh, robotics is a new field for us. AI is a new field for us. So we can skip or we can switch to any of those uh, skills. Uh, and uh, many of the industry professionals are looking for the skill set of a mechatronics engineer. So I would say uh, you, people are not uh, like I, I was reluctant. People are reluctant for this, but the future is very, very bright to be fair enough. What I see in the industry as well, uh, I have a very small exposure, but uh, people want uh, such kind of engineers, you know. Right. Very good. So that's all from my side. If you want to ask anything, you can ask. Otherwise, Ashish sir, you can continue. Ah. Uh, yes. Other, why I want to ask ask one thing as we are having Lucas Newell German Lab. So, why, how, how, as per your opinion, how did it help to become? How did it help you to become a mechatronics engineer? Mm -hmm. uh, the fact, the the facility that we have, most of the colleges in Indore do not possess. To be fair enough, we are the Shahrukh Khan of Indore. <laughs> <laughs> But uh, really, uh, the, the the facilities that uh, or the uh, uh, course also that is designed around it, uh, we like without Nikas, you have to design a model to identify or to see the things that we see on Nikas. Nikas provides a, a lot of simplicity to the complex circuits. Uh, if I remember it right, I'm not sure, uh, but it provides a lot of simplicity to the uh, concepts and I learned a, a lot of things about this. So like I said, I had projects also. So I could connect with those things while I was working on those uh, industry projects. So it helped me a lot. Okay, okay, that's great. Sir, any, anything other you want to say other than these, these are just the thing we have been we, we are <laughs> having in our mind. That's why we ask anything you want to say. Uh -huh. uh, uh, or I would, uh, I I was uh, I am very very grateful to be uh, the in a in a batch uh, from Symbiosis. I passed out in twenty twenty two, and I'm working and I think I would be you know uh, doing my masters in robotics, which I literally comes from mechatronics. I don't think I would be able to do those stuff without mechatronics. You know, just mechanical I would be pursued or electronics. It won't have helped me in the uh, in my future, uh, like what I see now, uh, mechatronics is a very unexplored skill in MP or uh, in Indore region. But uh, if we go through it now, so uh, we have a lot of prospects. And so, and Symbiosis does provide a lot of things, uh, the industry exposures. So, I, uh, yeah, I have, I might have forgot to mention that I also went to Egypt uh, through ISEC which I was, uh, which one of my seniors was a part of, and I got the opportunity from SWAS also. So we are not just uh, the studious guys, we interact, uh, we explore a lot of things outside the campus as well. So that is the that is the life that we have in Zimbabwe, I guess. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> nice to hear. Okay, uh, okay, sir, I think uh, we have already uh, discussed enough. Sharma, sir? Uh, Yes, yes, yes. Adhar, you yes, want sir. to say something, Adhar? Uh, no, sir. That, that's from my side. But okay. it was great interacting with you, sir. And I, think I, have, I, have, I, have, I have same here, same. First, uh, I guess I have first. 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 So, I have first. I guess 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 I have first. I yeah, yeah, we should be in regular touch. Okay. Yes. <laughs> all our alumni. Since you uh, missed your campus life, at least alumni life, you should enjoy it. Ah, <laughs> uh, definitely. Uh, I, I, I was, I signed up also for this alumni society that we have. So yeah, I'll, I'll definitely will be in touch. Okay. Yeah, yeah. So we need your support to reconnect mm -hmm. all our alumni. Ah, no issues. Uh, uh, anything from my end, I'll definitely. No issues, sir. Yeah. That's good. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh. Yes, sure. Thank, sure. thank you for giving your time and thank coming you. and discussing your experience. It is a, it was a nice experience talking with you. And uh, sure. let's uh, end this talk, sir.
yeah yeah thank you okay 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 thanks for thank you author thank you author thank you sir thanks a lot thank you thank you bye bye bye